having us here because I think it's a great uh, opportunity for us to showcase some of the great things that uh, the department uh, has has on tap. Uh, I guess I represent kind of the kind of the old school part of this, the more bricks and mortar side mm -hmm. of the game rather than the IT side. Um, I am the environmental officer for the department. I'm also the real property officer uh, responsible for property management, uh, energy, uh, along with a whole cast of other things. Right. Often, often consider myself responsible for everything else. Um, <laughs> Trust me, I understand <laughs> that issue. I was once the assistant secretary of management and had uh, all those that hodgepodge of issues there, and there's a, people, it's a lot more there than meets the eye. It's a lot like herding cats. Uh, yeah. But as you said, we are working with the General Services Administration on probably one of the largest uh, federal real property development activities with the uh, consolidation of mm -hmm. our headquarters at St. Elizabeth's. Uh, but in addition to that, we're also consolidating our other locations. So we're going to be neck down to about eight or nine locations when we're all finished. Uh, that alone uh, drives a tremendous opportunity to, to unify our, our, our systems, our approach to building management, energy management, sure. and sustainable practices. And since we're doing all this, we're able to build this into our, actual, into our acquisition strategy. Um, we're also working with our, uh, with our CIO to... Uh, uh, in ensure that we're bringing in uh, EP certified equipment uh, and we're working on, on energy management uh, capabilities to do just the kind of things that uh, were discussed earlier with uh, uh, power management sure. and the like. We have a major data center uh, consolidation effort going on with the, C with the CIO and right. uh, that uh, offers some tremendous opportunities. Yeah, really